Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Crystal and today, let's be honest, new year, same old me when it comes to Target hauls, they're never going to stop. So if you don't like Target, I'm sorry. Um, but I have a Target haul for you guys. It is mostly just like comfy clothes. That's it. No craziness, just like super comfy pieces. Um, so with that, we're going to jump right into it. I'm going to show you what I got and then we'll jump to a clip of me trying it on and everything will be linked in the description box down below for you guys. Unless for some reason I can't find any of it and then it won't, but I will link what I can. Okay. That is always my promise to you guys. I will link what I can. Okay. Let's just, let's just grab what's on top guys. First off is this two piece set and I cannot wait to put this on. Probably going to put it on as soon as I get done filming today because it is so soft. Okay. So this is the stars above brand. And if you know anything about target, you know, like stars above has amazing PJ sets and like, just like leisure sets. So this is kind of, to me, like a leisure set, just because where did this little piece of fabric come from? <laughs> just because it's like matching, the shorts aren't too short. I mean, let's be honest, they have nice size pockets as well. But just being honest, I would wear this out with some cute sneakers. I would wear this to run errands. I'm not even joking. Because two piece sets are so in. Why not? How would anybody know the difference between this gray pair of shorts and this gray long sleeve and any other leisure two-piece set that you would get from Boohoo or Misguided or whatnot? So anyways, here's the top. I got it in a size small. It does have this pocket in the front. Not my favorite, but... I can, I can deal with it. It is extremely soft and stretchy and the sleeves are cuffed at the end. So they aren't going to, they're going to be fitted at the end at your wrist. So that is really nice. They won't be like hanging and everything you try to touch. And then again, here are the shorts. They have a nice elastic band. They do have a drawstring and it is functional. And I got these in a small as well because these are made more for like women. Therefore, it's made for a booty, it's made for hips, it's made for someone who is through puberty, <laughs> you know what I mean? So, these are really, really nice. They do seem like they may be a touch see-through, so if you did wear these out of your house, I would just be very, very cautious to make sure you have on undies that you can't, like, see straight through um, the shorts. But... Let's throw on this magically buttery soft set and go ahead and fall in love because I already know it's going to be amazing. Okay, so one thing's for sure. I feel like the dark lip is definitely way too much with this very relaxed outfit. But with that, here it is. All right, so these shorts are a really, really good length. They are not too short, not too long. I am wearing them right at my belly button, so that is nice. You can pull them down more if you wanted to and make them even longer, but I'm okay with the length. It's like a little short of like fingertip length if you were going for that. The top, very, very comfortable, fits really nicely. Definitely true to size when it comes to a small, definitely true to size. It's not like something that fits a little bit more snug or oversized. Like it's it's a perfect size small for the shorts and the top. Both of them are amazing. And I can't get over how absolutely soft the material is. And the pockets are a nice big size. So if you are going up, up or down the stairs trying to carry a lot of stuff, you can stick your phone in your pocket. You'll have your hands free for other things. All that good stuff like 10 out of 10. I don't think I mentioned earlier, but these two pieces did come separately. They weren't together. 
I do believe the shorts were around $14.99 and I think the top was around $14.99 as well. So run about $30 bucks for the shorts and the top. The top may have been a little bit more expensive. I cannot remember. But like I said, I will let you guys know in the links down below. So, so nice, so comfy, love it. Okay, so next up I have like another two-piece set. This one is definitely geared more towards the younger crowd. Um, but, I mean, I'm in my 30s, so I really don't let my age determine what I'm going to wear. I wear what I want to wear. But what I'm saying is you might want to size up in this, which I did. I got a medium as opposed to a small, but here is the little top. It's just this cute, I would have said crop top, but I don't think it's really that cropped, but it is like a little tank. Um, I don't know how much bra we're gonna be showing because these sleeves do look pretty large. It does have a crew neck, so a higher neck than, you know, normal. Well, no, not, well, no. Tank tops, a lot of tank tops have a little bit lower neck. This looks like it's going to be pretty, like, high up. It has this band that's going to go, I don't know, because I did size up. Maybe this was supposed to be a crop top, and this would be, like, mid-waist. This would be, like, your waist, but I don't know. I thought it was really cute for, like, Valentine's Day. Me and my husband, we are not going to be fighting the crowds and being all crazy and going out to dinner on Valentine's Day. So, something cute, just wear at the house with the hubs and all that good stuff. And then here are the shorts. Again, we do have a functioning drawstring. These aren't, somebody out there with some squeaky brakes. These are not an elastic waistband really. Um, so you probably are gonna be relying on the drawstring. They do have some stretch, but all of it has stretch. I really can't feel, okay, what is this? We've got a string coming loose. Yeah, so, anywho, you know what I just realized? I ripped the tags off of everything. So, like I said, everything will be linked down below, but I will try to pop up a little screen grab from their website with the prices and stuff because I was a goober and I completely just ripped the tags off. Or someone did. I do not know where they went. Normally I keep the tag so I can tell you the price, but I didn't. These shorts do seem like they are going to cover the booty. They don't have pockets, so that is a huge bummer. But let's throw this on and see how it fits. I'm hoping the top doesn't look ill-fitting. Fingers crossed, but if not, the shorts are super cute and I will wear the shorts. Okay, so here's the little heart set. I will say, I feel like this fits really nicely. The shorts fit really nicely. I would size up, just my honest opinion. Uh, ignore this. You'll see this in a minute. I just went ahead and put it on. I didn't realize that this was going to cut in so much. So, one thing to keep in mind with this is if you are putting a bra on with this, you're going to need to wear a strapless one or a cute little bralette that you don't mind seeing the straps of because the neck goes in quite a bit. So even like a, a regular, like a traditional bra, you would be able to see the strap. So that is one thing to keep in mind. Also, I'm gonna go ahead and apologize in advance if I need to shave my armpits and you get a glimpse of it. Okay, my bad. <laughs> Two or three, I don't even know what number we're on. I understand that my face is probably darker than this. I had on a different shirt. You couldn't see the rest of it, so. We are in just, we are in, we are in a pickle here, but we're moving on. So here's this set. The shorts fit really nicely. They aren't too short. They aren't super long. I wouldn't qualify them as long, but they aren't too short. They are a decent length. These will be nice and comfy to sleep in. That is for sure. I don't know about this. I don't typically like to sleep in shirts that are so big that like, I could wake up and it's like turned a little bit and a boob is hanging out. So I don't know about sleeping in this top, but the shorts are a 10 out of 10 for sure. All right, so plaid has been in for a while now and it doesn't look like it's going out anytime soon. Everyone is still super obsessed with it and so am I. So I grabbed this really cute plaid top. I'm not gonna lie to you, 
this is a really soft material. I like how it's, it's, I would say on the thinner side, not in a bad way though. I think this will be more geared towards springtime as far as wearing it as just a top because it is thinner. It's not like super thick, which this one's pretty thin too. But just saying you might get a little chilly if you wore just this. I got it in a medium. I like my flannels, my plaid to be oversized. I don't like it to fit really snug. I feel more like a lumberjack when it's like super fitted to my body. So I did get this in a medium. This is Wild Fable. You guys know I love Wild Fable and I like what they're doing here with the two different prints. I've seen so many different tops that have the two like either um, different colors on each side or different prints. And here we have different colors and like a different print situation, but I really like this. I hope it looks as cute on as it did on the hanger. I don't know. I don't normally go towards blue very often, but there was just something about like this green, greenish yellow and the blue together that looked really nice. So let's throw this guy on and see what's up. Okay guys, so here is this flannel plaid shirt, whatever you want to call it. Here it is. And I'm having to be careful because Rosie is sleeping in the floor right here and I don't want to stomp on her. She is literally laying in the most inconvenient place she could lay. But, all right, so here is this top. Like I said, it's pretty thin. And again, I reiterate, not in a bad way. It is nice and soft, has a lot of give. I did go up a size, this is a medium. So it fits really, really nicely. It does cover the booty, so that is great. And I think this is super cute. I also think it will be really cute if you button up and then do like a front tuck into some jeans. I think that will be adorable. But then again, you can just wear it with a black shirt, some black leggings, and throw this on as an easy addition to a really basic outfit. I really like it. I don't recall if they had other colors, but you can always check down below and if they do, you can choose one of those as opposed to the blue if the blue is not your thing. But I really, really like this. I think it is adorable and definitely a good find. Two words, cozy set. That's all you need to know. Also, two more words, stars above. This is another stars above set. These did come separately. These are not sold together. Neither were the the first two pieces, the long sleeve gray top and the shorts, those were sold separately as well. I do remember the price of these two pieces just because I was looking at this set in a different color recently when I was in Target. The top is $24.99 and the pants are $24.99. So you are going to drop 50 bucks on this set. You're gonna have to really, really want it. Otherwise, I don't really think it's worth the money for you, but it is like this barefoot dreams material, which is absolutely just so soft and so luxurious. So, so nice. I feel like so many places, how many times can I say so? <laughs> so many places are coming up with more affordable dupes for barefoot dreams, which is awesome because a lot of people cannot afford to drop $120 on a sweatshirt and $24.99 is much more affordable ignore this thing. This was helping it on, stay on the hanger if you can even see this little plastic doodad. But it is just like this really nice muted soft mauvey pink color. It is so so soft. I cannot wait to wear this. This is going to be something that's constantly on my body as well. It is oversized. I did get a small just because it is oversized and as you can see even with it being a small it is still very very oversized. And then we also have these wide leg pants. The legs are quite wide, but I don't think they're like way wide or anything to where you would feel like an idiot. I think they're a good width. These are nice and heavy. They seem very well made. If they happen to be too long though, I do, nope, that is stitched. I was going to say you might could just like take the scissors and like lop off the bottom, which is still an option, but I don't know how much it would unfright if you did that. So definitely like that is a risk. 
you would have to take if you did like lop off the bottom. But again, a size small. And guys, I just love this. It seems so comfy. It seems like it's going to be true to size. I don't know. We'll know in a second when I throw it on. But it has a nice thick elastic waistband. I have a feeling these are probably meant to be like a high-waisted pant. And guys, everybody is wearing these sets. They are so comfy, so cozy. Again, something that might be meant more to wear around your home, but catch me wearing these outside. I will. I will wear this to the grocery store on one of those days when I have just hit the the F it button and have just decided like comfort over everything and cozy said it is. So let's throw this thing on. I have a feeling it's going to be amazing and I'm going to be in love with it as soon as I get it on my body, but let's see. <laughs> Okay, so this set is giving me life. I love this. It is amazing. If you don't have it, you need to get it. For sure. It's worth every penny, to be honest. This thing is so comfortable. The pants are so nice. They fit true to size. Like a small definitely fits like a small in the bottom and the top. The sleeves aren't too long, but you can pull them down over your hands a little bit if you like to do that, which I do. It is nice. The neck is a little bit larger, but nothing that's like terrible. You know what I mean? I really, really love this. Here's the back. It is nice. It covers up the booty, obviously because it's pants, but it doesn't feel like too tight on the booty or anything like that, but it does seem to look nice on the boot as well. So that's always a plus. I feel like you could wear these with a different top if you were a little too warm and you needed to put on like something that was a little bit more cool. So if you needed to take this off, you definitely could and put on a white t-shirt with these and no problemo. I know that you're probably thinking like it's meant to be worn at home. It's like cozy clothes. What do you care? Some people may you know, have people over but still want to wear like comfy, cozy clothes and you don't want to look terrible. I know back in the day, even if a lot of people were at my apartment, I still wanted on cute pajamas so they could see me in my cute pajamas and when we were taking pics, I looked cute. I wasn't coming out there looking busted. I mean, every once in a while I did. But the reason why I bring it up is how you can make a cute outfit out of stuff like this is for that reason. You have people at your house, you want to look cute, but you still want to be comfortable. Can't pass that up. Also, I would wear these pants out of the house. They are a perfect length right at the ankle. So that is a 10 out of 10. I really like these. If you are extremely tall, you might want to be careful though, because they may be too short for you. I would definitely try them on because these are the first pants like this I've tried on, like wide leg pants that are like really soft and cozy that aren't extremely short on me. So just throwing that out there, but I'm in love. Okay, last but not least, I have like a three piece set. This is more of like workout attire, but at the same time, it is like comfy clothes. To me, I don't work out in anything that isn't comfortable. So my workout clothes and my comfy clothes kind of like intermix, so. The Kai that checked me out when I got this, because these were purchased in two separate trips. My mom grabbed all this stuff for me when we were in Target one day. Love you, mom. And I grabbed this the other day when I was in Target. So the guy that was checking me out, they always ask, like, do you want to keep your hangers? And normally whenever I buy clothing at Target, I take all the hangers off before I get to the checkout. And I just hand them the hangers so it's quicker. Uh, but I totally like spaced out and didn't do that. And he was like, do you want to keep them? I was like, what is, whatever is easiest for you, sweetheart. If it's easier to leave them on, shove it in a bag. If it's easier to take it off, take it off. And he is the first person that has ever decided it was easier just to shove the hanger in the bag. So, <laughs> all right. So this, these are leggings from Joy Lab. And let me just like, Throw it back a little bit. I tried Joy Lab years ago. I think when Target first started selling their pieces. And I hated. I hated what I bought. I bought a pair of leggings. And I kind of just 
blindly got the size I normally got in whatever other leggings I was wearing, um, whatever brand it was. Through the board or across the board, I was typically a small, so that's what I got. They were so tight. I could get them on, but they were uncomfortably tight. They were just not going to be worn. I did end up getting rid of them. And then I kind of vowed then and there, I'm not trying Joy Lab again. No. And for years, I would pass, I will pass by that section in Target and everything is so cute and I love everything. And I'm just like, no, that one pair of leggings did me dirty. No. And this time I was like, all right, it's a new year. Let's, let's try something different. Let's give this brand a chance to redeem itself and see what's up. So I did grab a pair of leggings, but instead of getting a small, I got a medium. So they're not so tight that I don't want to wear them. So I did grab a medium in these and I do have the tags on still so I can tell you how much they were. $34. So not the cheapest leggings ever. That was kind of what ticked me off. And I know I could have returned them, but I am terrible about that stuff. I will keep stuff for months and months and months and keep saying, like, I'm going to return that. I'm going to return that. And then I just keep forgetting. So, anywho, $34 isn't the cheapest. So, I'm hoping I love these stupid things. But they have a lot. They have a good stretch, but they seem, like, really, really, like, tight. So, hopefully they will fit well, but also compress. They are this kind of like acid wash look. They are black, but kind of have like a gray tone. I don't know if it's coming up on camera. The booty, it does have the design that kind of lifts the butt. And it has like a cool little feature here on the thigh and stuff like that. But other than that, it's just like your typical like seamless legging. So we will see how those work. And then, I'm sorry for the crinkly bag. Let's get everything else. Okay. Then I also grabbed the matching sports bra because something I've been trying to do recently is if I get a legging, I've been trying to grab like a matching bra just because when you're trying to get back in the swing of working out, it kind of helps when you have like cute sets. And I'm someone that will start out working out in a t-shirt or whatever, but by the end of the workout, like, I'm just in my sports bra. This was 20 bucks. Do I think it was worth 20 bucks? I don't know. We will see. And I probably won't be able to tell you until I've actually, like, worn it and worked out in it. I did get a small in this because when it comes to the girls, you don't want them flopping around while you're working out, whether it be, like, hit or running or just, like, weightlifting or whatever. You want to keep the girls supported. So I did get a small in this, which does look to be like pretty true to size. So there's that. And then to go with it, I just couldn't pass this up. I love this mustardy yellow color. My mom always makes fun of me. She always has because I've always loved this color. And she's like, that is the ugliest color ever. But I love it. I got this in a size small and it is $34. So again, not the cheapest ever. And apparently it was up against something red because it has red string all over it. It has these cool little panel details in the bicep area. Yeah, I guess that would be the bicep area, which is really cool. Gives it a little bit of like fun detail. Has the same fabric at the bottom. The bottom banding, it does have a front pocket, which is really nice. It is a half zip. The inside material is not the same like Sherpa stuff, but it is very, very soft. So that is really nice. It has the same little material at the end of the sleeve. And yeah, I, I mean, I just really like this color. I think it's going to be really comfy and I think it will look really cute with the black. So this is the last set. We're going to throw these three pieces on and then we will be back to wrap up the video guys. Okay guys, so here is the sports bra and the leggings. All right, first of all, if you see a panty line, just ignore that. I'm not, I have rings on and I don't want to like dig in there to try to like smooth everything out. I don't, I doubt you can even see it, but I can feel them. 
All right, first off, I actually really like these leggings. They are very flattering, in my opinion. They seem very flattering. I will say this, though. I feel like I will continue to size up as opposed to getting a small because these were a pain to get on. Like, it's just like, you know, you're getting in them. Now, once you get them on, you're good to go. It's just the getting them on part. Here's the booty. So... Oh, let's put the tag up. Anyways, so here's the back of the sports bra. It does have a scoop. And this is one of those sports bras that kind of just like wants to like hang out to the side. So you definitely kind of, you know, be leery of that. But it's, they don't, it doesn't move too much. It seems pretty comfortable. And it's also not rolling up and the leggings aren't rolling down like when I bend over and when I move around. So that is great as well. So, so far, I approve of these. Now, like I said, I haven't worked out in these or anything. I don't know if they're going to be the type of leggings you have to continually keep, like, hoisting back up after you do, like, squats or something. So, I will have to keep you guys updated on that if anybody is interested after I've actually, like, worn them around. But let's throw on this fleecy guy and see how it fits. I don't think they had a medium in this guy or I probably would have been drawn to get the medium just because this sort of thing is like something you want to be oversized. But I'm glad I got the small because I feel like a medium would have been too oversized. This is actually really, really nice. It's really comfortable. It's really soft, but still like lightweight. It doesn't feel like I have on a big bulky like Sherpa. So that is really, really nice. I feel like my hair is probably a tragedy at this point, but I feel like this is nice. It will not cover the booty. You would have to go up a size or maybe even two to like fully cover the booty with this. So if that is something that you were looking for, this is not going to be it. It does have the band, so I think it's meant to be like worn more like this as opposed to pulled straight down, but it is still nice. I don't know if I would justify the price just yet. The leggings, I do, I, I do kind of get the price. They are very well made. They are very much like a compression legging, which is nice. And these are a great length. Like these go straight to my ankle, which is really nice. I don't have like a lot of fabric bunched up somewhere where they were too long. So that gets a 10 out of 10 for sure. I actually am in love with these leggings. The more I have them on, the more I really, really like them. So that's good though, because that means I can go and get more stuff like this from Target and try them out because they had some really cute colors in these leggings. That is for sure. They had a really cute purple and just other shades as well. So I may have to go pick up some more pair because these are more pairs because these are bomb. This top I know isn't going to be for everyone. It does come in different colors as well. So if you don't like this color, don't worry. It did also come in different, different colors for the people that don't love this mustardy greenish baby poop color. <laughs> Okay, guys, that concludes this Target try-on haul. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you found a little something-something to pick up for yourself. If not, honestly, I think you're missing out. These, some of these pieces are just so soft and so cozy. I don't know how you could pass up. As always, everything will be linked in the description box down below. If there's anything that you want me to test out, try out, try on, or talk about, leave it in the comments down below. I love chatting with you guys. I love hearing about you and just like kind of seeing you more as like a person than just like someone that's watching me, you know, because I don't get to physically meet you guys. So with that, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment down below. I just lost my train of thought. My brain broke. <laughs> I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Bye.